welcome to my adult coloring channel, Colorful Tomiko. This video is going to be a flip through of a weekly planner by Johanna Bashburn. Remember, if you like this type of flip through, to give it a thumbs up so that I know what kind of videos to bring you guys in the future. If you want to see more adult coloring videos like this one, please subscribe to my channel. Subscribing really helps in supporting my channel and helps with getting my channel in front of as many adult coloring YouTubers as possible. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you will be notified when I upload more videos to my channel. Now let's have some fun and get into this flip -through. So I have here a 2021 weekly coloring planner by Johanna Basper. If you like planners, this book may be for you. I like it because it's the mix of all her previous books in one book, plus a planner to keep you organized. I use it for planning videos on my channel, on here, but you can use it for anything and you get great pictures to color also. I know it's now April, but I still wanted to share it with you guys anyhow. I think she comes out with one every year. So if you want to get this one or the next one when it comes out, feel free to do so. I'll link in the description a link to Amazon where I got the book. So this one actually has a couple of her books, illustrations from a couple of her books, um, illustrations from How to Draw, Inky Wonderlands, World of Flowers, um, her book Ivy and the Inky Butterfly, her book The Magical Jungle, her book Johanna Christmas, Lost Ocean, Enchanted Forest, and Pictures from Secret Garden. So let's take a look inside. Now I did start um, planning in my planner so I won't show you guys what I'm planning for the channel. I'll just show you the pictures of what's in the book but it's also a planner and it's a daily a weekly planner and actually I'm moving just a little bit closer so you guys can see the pictures up close there so now we're a little closer and and at the beginning it has the calendar for two for 2021 And I'm just going to scoot it over a little bit just so you guys can see that side and not see my actual plans that I have written out. And I think this one is from How to Draw Inky Wonderlands. But if you are looking for a planner, I thought this was a great book for colorists who are looking to have the best of both worlds. You can color in, you can plan out your day. And I think this one is from, um, hmm, if I had to take a guess, I would say Secret Garden. Not sure though. I know this one is from Ivy and the Inky Butterfly. And here's another one. I think this one is from Worlds of Flowers. This one looks like it's from Magical Jungle. And this one I'm pretty sure is from Secret Garden. I love this one. And I think I might color this one in the actual book. But the other thing that I like about it is that it's a very small size. And it's not the normal size of a book. So if you need a shorter version of her book, this would be a good one. And this is for February. So on the other side, it has the dates and stuff for you of the week for you to plan out. And it has one side 
a picture and one side the dates. And so I think this one is from Words of Flower because I actually colored this picture in her book. I also like the paper that's in the book. It seems like it's pretty good paper to be a planner. So if you're actually looking for something that still has good paper, this would be a good one. This is from Lost Ocean. I remember this picture. I'm not sure which one this one is from. I think this one is from Inky Wonderlands or something like that. This one is from Magical Jungle. And I think I'll color this one. I want to color this one. So hopefully one day you guys see me color this here on the channel. Also, if there's something in here that you want to see me color, leave it in the comments. And I will be sure to get that video to you guys. This one's from Lost Ocean again. It's like crabs. And this is for April. As you can see. So the pictures are on one side. So if you if you were to have some bleed through, this would be that would be okay if you wanted to use markers. And I think this is from World of Flowers. I like this page too. The turtle. This is a pretty page. And I think I might color this page also. So this this is a good page for like fine liners because this one is really, really small. And it's a very small picture. So there's no way you're really going to be able to do that with pencils. I would do it with fine liners if I could. And this is from Ivy and the Inky Butterfly. World of Flowers. Ivy and the Inky Butterfly. And so this is June. So that's how the planner part looks. Magical Jungle, World of Flowers, I don't remember what book this one is, I think it might be Secret Garden, but I'm not sure, or Enchanted Forest, yeah this is Enchanted Forest. Seashells. We have just flowers. The only thing about this book is that the pictures are small, but you get a shorter version, like I said, so the pictures are smaller. So it will be much harder for me to show how I color this on my channel, but I guess I could try to color some pages that's bigger. Like this page. I like this page. It's comes from her Lost Ocean page, from her Lost Ocean book, I mean. Now we're into August. So I think you get each week, because this is August and September. So I'm thinking you get each week of the month as a planner. And this is Lost Ocean. And then you get 
the first week of September. So that's how it goes along in the book. I think this is um, Enchanted Forest. Ivy and the Inky Butterfly. World of Flowers. Secret Garden. I don't remember which one this one is from. Lost Ocean. I think this is from the Inky Wonderland one or something. That's a pretty one. I like that one. So yeah, if you want like a mix of all of her books together instead of getting each book, you can get a couple of pictures out of each book. It's just that the pictures are smaller. So if you want bigger pictures, I suggest you get the whole book. This is her um, Christmas book, Johanna's Christmas, and this is November. So I guess that's why it's the Christmas one. This is November and December. And another Christmas one for December. Another Christmas one. Another Christmas one. Another Christmas one. Just December and January. And so it goes all the way up to January 2022. And then you have a couple of pages for each month in 2022. And then there's a calendar in the back with 2020, 2022, and some of my notes in a notes page. And that is the end of the book. And another thing I like about the book is that it's spiraled for you already. So that would be the end of this flip through and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, please don't forget to subscribe and have a colorful day. Bye.